The future is coming, and it looks like this. A major reshuffle across the premier class, banned winglets, and a new manufacturer. After an amazing race in Valencia, the 2016 MotoGP season has come to a close, and we have seen history being rewritten multiple times. In this episode, we go over round 36 of the Fan World Championship and talk about the provisional riders and teams that have been announced for the MotoGP class in 2017. It was Jorge Lorenzo's last race with Team Movistar Yamaha and the season finale of the 2016 MotoGP Championship. And the rider managed to make each of those memorable, winning the Valencian GP, a perfect parting gift for Yamaha. The final race saw Marc Marquez finish second, while Andrea Iannone finished third despite an injury. The 2016 FIM ceremony officially closes the spectacularly epic MotoGP season, crowning Marc Marquez the youngest five-time world champion as the 2016 MotoGP world champion. Valentino Rossi came in second place and Jorge Lorenzo came in third. Other notable awards include Tito Rabat winning the Rookie of the Year award and Cal Crutchlow taking the win for the top independent team rider. Provisional riders and teams have been announced for the MotoGP class in 2017. Less than 48 hours after hostilities ended in 2016, the first shots were fired in the battle for supremacy in the new year. Jorge Lorenzo is splitting ways with the teammate Valentino Rossi to join Dovi on the factory Ducati team. Lorenzo is replacing Andrea Iannone, who will be moving to Suzuki X-Star. Iannone will be taking the place of Maverick Vinales, and Vinales will be joining Rossi on the factory Yamaha team, filling the boots of Lorenzo. Also leaving Suzuki is Alexis Bargaro, who will be joining Sam Lowe's who is moving from Moto2 to MotoGP and the Aprilia team. Corel Abraham and Alvaro Bautista will be replacing Yanni Hernandez and Eugene Laverty to join the Pull and Bear Ducati team. Alex Renz will be teaming up with Iannone on Suzuki. Other riders moving from Moto2 to MotoGP are Jonas Folger and Johan Zarco, who are replacing Bradley Smith and Paul Spargaro. Yamaha Tech 3 riders who are making the jump to the first factory KTM MotoGP team. While the rest of the riders will remain the same, the 23 rider provisional looks to be an exciting lineup for the next year. In the race for the Fan World Championship title this week, round 36 third place rider was Jack Miller, with Andy Lai pulling the Estrella Galicia contributors through the checkered flag to the third place victory. Overtaking Jack Miller at the last minute and taking the second place on the podium this week was Sam Knott, who is racing and supporting Eugene Laverty and the Pull and Bear team, making a tremendous victory flying through the finish line into second place. The rider ripping to the top this week was Loris Baz, being led by Rio K, who has been on the podium for two weeks in a row now. Huge congrats to Kay, Baz, and everyone else who competed in the Fan World Championship this week. We have a quick tip this week brought to you by Brembo, the official MotoGP brake system. Log in every day to receive your daily login reward. Every day that you do this, you will receive a generous amount of coins and diamonds. This week on social media, we take a trip to the past to check out some posts from your favorite MotoGP riders. Jack Miller got onto Instagram and posted this awesome picture supporting MotoGP Championship Quest. Thank you, Jack Miller. Another rider that has shown his support has been Cal Crutchlow. He posted this photo of him on the track. Huge thanks to Cal Crutchlow for the support. Andrea Iannone was featured on MotoGP.com for sporting his new Suzuki livery, and it looks super futuristic. If you are a Valentino Rossi fan, make sure to show your support by signing the Rossi Award. After you sign the Rossi Award, take a picture and post it with the hashtag EostoConRossiAward to partake in the monthly photo contest. The winner for this month is Janie Fetchruri from Indonesia with runner-up VR46 fan page from England and they get Valentino Rossi avatars 
and so can you. Use the hashtag Yosokonrasi Award as well as MotoGP Championship Quest and take a picture. Subscribe and keep your eyes peeled for updates. Comment what your thoughts are below and then go start a race in the Fan World Championship. Big congrats to all the riders and teams who raced and supported the riders in this week's championship quest. Lorenzo on a Ducati, Iannone on a Suzuki, and Vinales with Rossi on a factory Yamaha. I can feel the hair on the back of my neck sticking up already. And we thought 2016 was good. Well, that's all we have for you today, guys. We hope you enjoyed the show. As well as supporting our favorite riders in MotoGP, we will also be supporting riders of various other motorsports who suffer career-ending injuries through our partnership with Road to Recovery. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And don't forget to race as your favorite rider in the Fan World Championship. that adds to a very distinctive layout over the circuit's 4,005 meter distance. The anti-clockwise design... Oh, actually, I didn't get to... I didn't get to...